Hello, I'm Kev at Rimmers Music. I'm going to show you this uh, C40 by Yamaha. What does the C stand for? The C stands for classical. So this is a classical guitar as opposed to an acoustic guitar. So what's the difference between acoustic and a classical? The main difference is this has got six nylon strings as opposed to six steel strings on an acoustic guitar. So this has got uh, three nylon strings and then another three nylon strings that are wound in steel. Uh, so it doesn't need, this guitar doesn't need what's called a truss rod, which is a steel rod that runs from here to here that, that reinforces the guitar. There isn't one in this. There is one in all acoustic guitars because steel uh, gives a lot more pull than nylon. So, for example, if you were to buy uh, a classical guitar with nylon strings, you like the way how it feels, you know, in a few months' time, you think, oh, can't quite afford an acoustic guitar. I'll just buy some steel strings and I'll put them on my classical. No, 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 no. What would happen then is your guitar would just go like that, it'll burn banana, and more often than not, just snap. Okay, so yeah, two totally different car uh, guitars. Classicals are often referred to as Spanish guitars, flamenco guitars. So that <laughs> that kind of thing okay so yeah very affordable accessible guitar uh, often used by people who aren't quite sure if they want to take it up but they want to give it a go now the main there's two main reasons for that the nylon strings don't hurt your fingers half as much as what steel strings do at first basically when you you're starting to learn to play you, your fingers will grow calluses and you'll just they'll just become hardened to it so it's a good idea if you've never touched a guitar in your life to start with a, a classical guitar maybe move on to uh, an electric or an acoustic and see how you go all right it's all they're also good if you're you're a guitarist and you've not got a classical guitar but you've got electrics and acoustics then you just want something with a bit more mellow of a tone you know it's uh, totally different i mean i i'm a electric guitarist i play acoustic as well now i do a lot of recording and i've got i've got one of these it's it's for them uh, them songs that just require something that's not as bright as an acoustic not as uh, twangy as, as an electric. You just want that mellow kind of vibe. Uh, yeah, classical guitars, they are, they're fantastic. So, without further ado, I'll play you some uh, some little pieces for you, just some, some bits and bats. Uh, predominantly, you do use your fingers in, as opposed to a plectrum. That's not to say you can't use a plectrum course you can. If you want to use plectrum, you can do. It will be louder, so I'll just give you an example. Just a thumb strum. It's going to be louder, it's going to be brighter. That's a piece of plastic essentially, Tortex plastic. Uh, so that's sitting nylon string. It's going to be brighter than the warmth of your thumb. Alright, so yeah, I'll just play a few little picky bits and then uh, do some strumming just just with my uh, fingers and then we'll do the same thing with a plectrum all right so
so I'll just do the same thing, but using a plectrum, just to show you that you can. All right. Drummed. So, that's that then. I'll just tell you a bit about the wood. This is all laminate wood. <clears throat> uh, so, the top is spruce top, which will give you that brightness. Uh, the back and the sides, Marenti. So, that's, uh, it leans towards the uh, lower frequencies, the lower mids and the bass frequencies. Uh, the neck is NATO, very popular uh, wood on guitars. A lot of the electrics use NATO as well. Uh, the fretboard, so it's this piece of wood here, it's like a thin veneer on the neck, you can see. That's rosewood, uh, as is this uh, the bridge here, saddle. All right, uh, yeah, that's about it. So it's the Yamaha C40. Ideal for beginners and ideal for any guitarist who wants that a little bit of a different tone, a different sound. Okay, so yeah, check us out at rimmersmusic.co.uk. The link to purchase this will be in the bio. Uh, I've been Kev, and I'll see you again soon. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.